Well, there's a new warning for parents about increased melatonin poisoning in kids. U.S. poison centers say they received more than 52,000 calls about melatonin poisoning last year. Over the 10-year study done by the CDC, more than 4,000 children were hospitalized. The CDC says that the number of poisonings increased 38% during the pandemic. Now, experts are weighing in with what you need to look out for. So some of these have to do with respiratory depression and being over sort of overly sleepy. I think that is um, that is is one of the things. And um, I think that it's important to note that um, for with any kind of medication, um, using it kind of on your own or going rogue can be uh, can be put yourself in a tricky position. So I always er, encourage everyone to discuss any time they're going to add a supplement or any type of medication. Talk about it with your pediatrician first so that you can get some guidance about how to proceed. Dr. John says if you think your child is overdosing to call the number for the National Poison Control Center, that number is 1-800-222-1222.